Hey everyone, welcome to day five of our Bryce Sew Along. Today we're going to start by sewing up our side seams. So I'm going to take my back bodice pieces and open them up, and then I'm going to match right sides together. So we'll make sure that we match lining to lining, and then main fabric to main fabric with right sides together again, and that will enclose this side seam. Before I start sewing, I'm just going to open up the other side and go ahead and put clips there as well, and then I'll sew up both sides at the same time. So again, I'm going to match up my seam, and then I'll match lining to lining and main fabric to main fabric with right sides together. I accidentally forgot to hit record while I was sewing up these side seams, but you'll just stitch those up with a 3 8 inch seam allowance. Then you can turn it right side out. You'll see that side seam is nice and enclosed. And then we are all done with the side seams. That was quick and easy and pretty painless. And now if you're doing the crop version, we can go ahead and work on our crop band. The crop band is pretty quick and easy. You can construct the band just like you would any real waistband, neckband, armband, all of those things. And I actually linked the Knit Bands 101 blog post that we have in today's blog post. So if you need a little bit more information, you're looking for some more tips, I did link that for you. First, we'll sew up the short edges. And then you fold it in half with wrong sides together, and I'm going to find the quarter points. Once you found the quarter points on the band, go ahead and find the quarter points on the raw edges of your top as well. After you find the quarter points of the waist opening of those raw edges, then we are going to match up quarter points. So we will match up all the raw edges, matching them up at the quarter points.
I just put a few extra clips in place and then I'm going to stitch that up with a 3 8 inch seam allowance. If you're doing the crop version, you are all done. You can set that to the side and work on the next version that you've started. If you're doing the sleeve version, we're going to start by attaching our sleeves. So I'm going to match up the center notch with the shoulder seam, and then I will match up my front and back notches and then ease the rest of the sleeve in. Once you've attached your sleeve with right sides together, we're going to sew up those side seams. If you want, you can baste the side seams beforehand. I know it is several layers of fabric, but I'm just going to go ahead and clip them in place and then I will sew that up with the 3 8 inch seam allowance. Just turning my bodice right side out and then I'm going to attach the second sleeve on the opposite side.
Once you've attached your sleeves, you have the option of hemming them, or if you wanted to leave them raw, you could do that. Tomorrow is day six, and we will attach our skirt waistband and then our skirt as well. We'll see you then.